Hey everyone, Shortheny Forum Tano here, the internet's busiest music nerd. I hope you're doing well. I'm doing great. I took a nap. I got my coffee. I'm feeling large and in charge. And I'm ready to talk about uh, the wild and interesting world of short form content. It's the new wave. It's a genre of content that I myself uh, engage in. Although I will admit a lot of the time, I feel like one of the only reasons I have anything to do with it in the first place is because it has been so impactful and influential in the music space. In fact, there are countless artists, albums, and hit songs at this point that wouldn't be the household names that they are if not for the viral trends that are cropping up within these uh, short form algos, many of which I enjoy myself and ultimately I think it's a cool thing. However, because on any given platform you are kind of at the mercy of the algorithm, it's difficult to explore any of these trends organically. And I have to be absolutely real with you, no pun intended. I've pretty much given up on Instagram reels as a means of introducing me to any good, new, interesting, current music. Every single time I open the app, it literally gives me the worst music you could possibly imagine over and over and over and over. I came from a sperm bank, but the problem is that I didn't know who my father was until I realized that my girlfriend had the same damn description of who he was. We were cousins. It's to the point where I'm actually not phased by trash mainstream music anymore. You may in fact like hear a, a bit of a shudder in my voice because of how afraid I am of the music that Instagram Reels shows me on a regular basis. I am in fact terrified of the music that is just being posted to Instagram Reels every day, which is why I thought I would come online here in this video and uh, subject you guys to that experience too. Transition, what we are looking at here is literally the first thing that I have been hit with the moment that I open up Reels on Instagram. From this point, we will travel together uh, into the Reels rabbit hole. And here's some of the stuff that Mark Zuckerberg has been torturing me with. Now, again, I, I have not listened to this clip in full. This is the first thing that popped up literally the moment I opened Instagram. And obviously, given the intro of the video and the first bit of text that we're hit with, we're about to be subjected to a song, presumably an original from an amateur, an up and coming artist, because uh, I, I have no idea who this person is. Maybe he's world famous. Maybe he's got a platinum plaque or two. I assume he's still kind of, you know, trying to get his name out there since he's pitching his music on Instagram Reels. So with that being said, let's give this song a shot and see what it's got. Met you once or twice more and now it feels like a relapse. I'm so addicted to just relax. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I kind of like him off, then he returned and I'm brand new. Okay, not 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 the not the tweak in falsetto. Also, I love the self-assured like, yeah, mm, yeah. Uh. This is uh pretty rough. Let's uh, uh go further into the algorithm and see what else we've got. POV, your uh, God, you're a fan of Eminem slash Logic, and this shows up in your feed. Okay, I mean, I I suppose um. I, I do like some Eminem and I do like some logic. I mean, both of those things are true, but I don't think that means I should be subjected to the torture that you are about to put me through here, sir. Go off, go off. They say I'm a show off. I've been working day in, day out till this shit gon' pay off. All of my life I've been out in the dark, scared of my own shit, I live in the dark. That person's grabbing him and is like, please stop, man. Stop, just stop, just stop rapping. <laughs> Could you stop bouncing over my lifeless body and uh, uh, doing your little triplet flows? You interpolated the, the fucking ice cream truck song? Like, what are you doing? This doesn't sound like Post Malone or Green Day. Let me know if my new song is trash, I'll retire. Okay. Um. That's a lot of pressure. I don't know if I should decide if this guy should retire, but um, I, I guess we'll see. Did someone say creator? Huh? He said, here I am. What? Did someone say savior? Yeah. He said, that's the plan. Did someone say Jesus? Jesus. He said, take my hand. <laughs> Jesus, I 
me this I know For the Bible told me so Yeah, the ones that hit me long But they are wicked, he is strong The retirement thing, it's in God's hands It's just a moment I'm like this battle in the sea Pause! What is this vocal delivery? Born to be an artist, born to be a star, born to walk around on Hollywood Boulevard. I wrote the most savage breakup song using all 50 states. I suppose in concept, it's a creative writing exercise. Uh, let's hear how the music sounds. When Idaho don't grow potatoes, Virginia don't support our trends and hopes. Colorado ain't that high. Indiana stops shooting hoops. Okay, 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 I got it. When New York stops eating pizza. You could call me a vampire because when I'm around only things with blood transpire and I'm as scary as a spider. <laughs> Should I make this flow into a song? You know, it'll probably be better than most of the stuff I've seen so far. So why not? I'm, I'm giving it the green light. I'm giving it the go ahead. L let's, let's do it. Let's go. So I never had car sex. <laughs> okay, um, too much information off the bat. I'm gonna keep going and um I'm sorry buddy nobody's going to rick roll their friends with this song and I'm sorry have we lost grasp of like 80s pop and new wave and synth pop we're we're, we're just calling this style this aesthetic this era of music Rick rolls now. Rick Astley didn't die for this. He's still alive, but still, he didn't die for this. Long that your girl been without it. She been looking for something real. But it's hard to find in this modern time when it's, well, you know the deal. Too long that your boy been without it. He been looking for something true. But okay, all right, all right. We're being a little bit too horny on Maine. I'm sorry, but I mean, I have to, I, I have to, I have to call a foul here because being this horny right off the jump on Instagram reels in, in the middle of the afternoon, it truly is foul. In the sheets, I'm animals, I'm slurping up all the no, no, ah, is a rock song for all the bad girls out there. Okay. All right. All right. Stop, stop, stop. All the naughtiest shoddies are going to love this song. So come corrupt me over. Put me under your spell. All right, this is going to be the last one because I don't think I could subject myself to much more of this. Uh, Jam Wayne over here is a guy who I'm actually very, very familiar with through my Instagram reels. Uh, my Instagram reels algorithm loves to show me his music, actually. Um, so we're going to check out this track, No Problems, that I have not heard before, but it's it's apparently out on all platforms so um let's see as the world on till everybody leroy left had to put the south on drill about this here yeah mama with a head now i'm mobbing in the streets i live let me make this clear what's the third bridge in the country blue car tried and true and if it comes down to it and you cross that line in the red white and blue boy you better salute all right listen um even though aesthetically and Philosophically, I, I just can't really get into Jam Wayne's particular brand of Patriot Trap. It's not my vibe. It's not my tempo. I will say vocally, uh, flow-wise, production-wise, he he is one of the more solid uh, musicians who turns up in my Instagram reel. Like he does, kind of have a, a decent voice for rap. It's, it's, you know, it's got a good tone to it. It's gruff. It's macho. I mean, the delivery and the production style is like a tad bit dated. He seems about eight to 10 years behind the times a little bit. And I can't really hear his songs without wondering where he was on Jan 6th. But still, you know, with that being said, like th this is definitely not on like the, the more garbage end of the spectrum of, of, of what we've been exposed to today. So thank you, Instagram Reels. But yeah, that's uh, pretty much what my Instagram Reels algorithm has been putting me through as of late. So uh, yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys thought of any of these tracks uh, that we listened to together. What's your favorite? What's your least favorite? You're the best over here next to my head is another video that you can check out. Hit that up or the link to subscribe to the channel. Uh, Anthony Fantano, Reels forever.